I don't know why, but I do. All right, Kevin, it's about the morning show. Uh, it is about that time of news you can use. What up, K? Hey, what up, Rick? Uh, I got some good stuff today, man. Great stuff today. Uh, we're going to start it off with a controversial new sponsor. I don't know what's controversial about this. Nick Cannon has a new venture in the world of food. Not only is he going to be uh, got a new TV show, but he also has a new venture in the world of food. Uh, just in time for the summer cookout season, Nick Cannon's Raw Dogs. And the Raw stands for Real Authentic Wieners. Uh, apparently, Nick is getting into the, uh, <laughs> the hot dog business. And uh, I think that's a, you know, that's, that's a good thing. So, uh, yeah, so check out Nick Cannon's Raw Dogs, Real Authentic Wieners. Uh, the slogan is, top it with chili cheese and slaw, because it's no good if it ain't raw. So, make <laughs> sure you... Go on and give us the news now, man. We heard you. Oh, man. Rock, you going to try those? Oh, man. I don't know, dog. <laughs> you going to throw some of those on the grill for Crystal and Lil Rocky and, uh, you know... <laughs> I know how you like to get out on that back deck and get it, get it get cracking. Out on what? I like it. I know how you like to get out on that deck and get it cracking. You know, get out on that deck and, and break out them raw dogs. Real authentic wieners from Nick Cannon. Woo! Make sure you get out there. Oh, man. Rocky got a pretty big deck back there, don't you? Didn't you, didn't you build a new deck oh, th- over the winter? Didn't you add on to your deck that you had already? <laughs> They said Crystal, uh, Crystal really enjoyed Gary, your deck. You, Gary, you, you never went over there and, and, uh, and sat on Rock's brand new deck? <laughs> you know, I, I was just with him the other day, um, last week. I'm like, my God, you're being very stingy. He didn't show you his new deck. <laughs> no, he didn't show me his new deck. Yeah, because yeah, like, I heard he, that he expanded it, and it was, uh, yeah. it was really nice. Okay, he we've heard shit. enough about his home improvement activities. <laughs> okay, he all right. Some good oh, cedar wood. All right, all right. Was that cedar, Woo. Rock, to you? Uh, yeah, because <laughs> cedar is the hardest wood, right? Yes, I like cedar. Because you really need, yeah, you really need your deck to be extremely hard because people are walking around on it and you want it to last through the yeah. summer. We had a shepherd row growing up. It was problem. made of cedar. It was a, yeah, that hardwood. Oh, was, was it? Good. Yeah. Oh, nice. All right, so uh, <laughs> we good oh, now? Man. All right, so the parents of children in this upcoming school year need to take notes. I said we got new social sensitivity rules is what they're calling them, Maria. Social sensitivity rules that's coming up. Uh, and these gonna, are going to apply from elementary all the way through college. So oh. make sure that you take notes of this uh, new woke sensitivity rule. So the rule of I before E except after C no longer applies if it makes a child feel better about themselves to put the E before the I. So uh, let's see. Uh, 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 um, A, E, I, O, and U are no longer the only vowels. All right. Mm. A, E, I, O, and U are no longer the only vowels. If it makes a child feel better to say B, C, H, or T is a vowel, then that choice needs to be respected. Now, 2 plus 2 technically still equals 4. But if a child says it equals 7, then that opinion must be respected. Now, the the greater than <laughs> or less than, yeah. These are new rules, Rick, that's going into effect. The greater than or less than signs can no longer be allowed in math because we don't want to make the less than number feel inferior. So in the new right. math... In the new right. math, 50 is equal to 100. Mm. Right. So if you want 50 to be the same as 100, it could be the same. Now, uh, finally, <laughs> equations I, such as if Johnny has rules, three I apples. I would have graduated all the time with these rules. Yeah. Right. If Johnny has three apples in one hand <laughs> and puts one apple in Jimmy's hand, how many apples does Johnny have? You can't use this equation no more because it's not right for children that don't have hands. <laughs> right. Right. And it's also unfair to kids with small hands because Johnny got to have a really big hand to hold three apples in the first place. So make sure y'all pay attention to these rules. These are the new woke rules for the upcoming school year 2023. Boy, I swear, you and ain't also, lying with none of this. And also make sure y'all check out Nick Cannon's new uh, venture in the world of food. Nick Cannon's Raw Dogs. <laughs> Top it with chili cheese and slaw. It ain't no good if it ain't raw.